What we did in DACA is we put hundreds of monitors we did across the city. The thing that was surprising to us is that compared with other cities, we found less variability. So in the sense that we anticipated that some places would be a lot more polluted than others or have a lot higher noise if you were in a commercial area versus a res residential area versus an industrial area. I think we found actually less variability than we would have anticipated, meaning that it, it, in terms of inequalities, everyone's exposed to very high levels of pollution with slightly higher exposures in slums, slightly higher exposures in places that, that are closer to industrial areas, which tended to be poorer communities. But at least for us, one of the big take home messages is like, there just needs to be a huge effort to just start getting PM 2.5 down across the city.